low impact cardio, high intensity, just need your runners and a mat nearby. So we'll start with our warm up. First move is just step touches. Let's relax the shoulders and just go step touch side to side. So all low impact, high intensity, 45 minutes cardio. So moving slower or quicker your pace, listen to your body, take breaks as you need to. 30 seconds. Relax the shoulders, stepping it out side to side. Next move, arm swing, toe tap, 30 seconds. It's just warming up the body, helping the body tune into the workout. Tune into being here, your workout, your time to strengthen your heart, strengthen your cardiovascular system, clear the mind, and feel excellent all day. They reach with those arms. Bring it back in, step touch again. Just warming up, shoulders down, stepping wide. Starting to open it up now, get a little bit more movement, a little bit more pace going, getting the body warm quickly. Toe tap, arm swing. Now starting to bring those arms a little bit higher, starting to feel the heart rate elevate. Ready for the workout. Working in intervals today, so 45 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Starting in just one more minute. Hands to your hips, you're just gonna stretch side to side. Let's add those arms. Reach, 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 reach. Push your hips back, keep the chest up. Nice long straight spine. Next one is just deep plies and then rise. Last one for the warm up, warm and ready. Let's go down and up, down, up. So starting the workout, 45 seconds on, 10 seconds off. First move is a deep squat and a rise. That's all we're doing, deep squat, rise. But cardio, so we're trying to pick up the pace. Drop low, squeeze your upper back. Making sure you're pushing your hips down and back. Nice reach, squeeze the glute on the top. Good, so it's all low impact, high intensity, big calorie burn. Twenty seconds. All right, deep squat. You're going to hold the squat. And you're just going to jab straight forward. Make sure you come nice and low in the hips. Starting in five seconds. Go, jab, one, two, one, two. Low in those hips. Get those arms moving quick as you can. High intensity. Great impact for the heart. Squeeze your tummy, get the core working. Come a little lower in your legs. Drop squat, 
and the heel raise at the top. Drop squat, heel raise at the top. The legs are hip distance. Shake it out, walk it out, whatever you need on that break. Let's go. Down, heel raise. Swing in those arms and lift your heels right up. So it's a no repeat workout. All new moves. Get that heart rate up. High intensity, low impact, 15 seconds. Right leg only, single lunge. So right leg back and the left arm pump. So single lunge. Walk it out, march it out. Right leg only, go back, back, back. So shift your weight forward to your left foot, right hand to your hip, moving quick with control. Good, how good are you feeling right now? You're feeling strong, you're feeling fast, you're feeling energized. Keep that pace. Fifteen seconds, pick up the pace. Good job. Before we go to the other side, just a little granny jog. So it doesn't have to look pretty, I just want you to get that heart rate up. Max heart rate on this one. 45 seconds, go. So it's low impact, you're pumping your arms, get those legs moving quickly. Feels good to work hard. Feels good to put in your best and to feel energized all day. Come on, rocking it, fast feet. Twelve seconds, a little quicker. Go. Left leg lunge, so it's that single lunge. So left leg, right arm, all the weight comes into that right leg. Abs engaged, spine straight. Let's go, hop. One, two. You can always slow it down. You can always speed it up. Keep pace. Keep your pace. It's strong and quick. Almost there, pick it up a little quicker, you can do it. Next one is a little squat, little pivot, squat, pivot, squat. And you don't have to add the little jump. You can always just walk it out. Let's go down, down. Walk it out if you want a little easier option. Stay low to the ground, keep it low impact. You can do it. Whew. Next one. You're just going to go toe touches. Bring it in. Now, you can slow it down here. You can use this one as recovery. Or you come with me and you speed it up. Come on. Your workout, you mean your personal best, your strongest, your fastest. Toe touches. Feels good to be strong. 
Feels good to be fit. Keep it up. Twenty seconds. Keep it up. We got knee crossovers. So you're gonna cross, cross. Okay, so knee drive. Make sure that you're crossing knee to opposite shoulder. Go. Great one for the core. Get that rotation. Squeeze your tummy. seconds pick up the pace use your abs pull me right up towards the chest and towards the opposite shoulder <sighs> walk it out next one is a three count pulse knee drive and you're gonna change knees okay so three count pulse knee drive let's go drop nice and low two three right knee three two left knee three two right knee push your hips back make sure the knees stay safe so hips are back and three two three two one three two one get that knee drive squeeze your tummy three two one three two get low in those legs get that good thigh burn and three, two, one, three, two. Awesome. Knee crossover repeater. So right knee to left elbow. Keep your weight all on that left leg. Recovery. Time to work. Let's go. Crossover repeater. Keep the chest up, but stay low on your left leg. Feel that amazing party in your body, right? Everything's feeling good now. Starting to feel those feel-good hormones pumping through you. The endorphins are your best friend. Come on, get some more. Pump a little quicker. Elbow to knee. And you pick up the pace. Come on, your workout. Oh, lock it out. Don't just stop on that break. So left knee cross over repeater. Make sure you squeeze your tummy. Nice big out breath, big energy. Let's go. Keep your head up, chest up. Focus on pace. Focus on form. All your weight is in that front leg. Come on, quick breathing, that's good. Getting that heart rate up a little higher. All low impact, high intensity, max calorie burn. Keep up the pace. The next one, we're down. So if you tend to get lightheaded, you're up here for a march. High march, or if you're down with me, you can use some dumbbell supports for your wrists if you like. All right, so it's a double crouch, double knee pump, jump in. Crouch twice, knee pump. Keep your head up, because that heart rate's going. Don't let your head dip. Double crouch, knee pump. How's your heart rate? No break, huh? Keeping that heart rate up. Getting a max calorie burn today. Get max energy in the body. Double pump. Get your form perfect. Squeeze your abs as you pump your knee in. Pump back, feel your thighs. One, two, one, two, head up. Doing great, guys. Stay with it. And one, two. Awesome. 
Awesome, have a little break while I show you the next one. It's either single leg out and then walk it in or we're going to jump out, jump in. You don't have to, right? Stick with option one if it's too much. So knee tuck, jack, knee tuck, jack. Come on, hard workout, that's why you're here. That's why you arrived, you love hard workouts. Strong form, keep your head up. Shoulders get a break after this. Keep pushing. Oh, burning off our dinner from last night for sure. All right guys, high knee crunches. Just pull the knee right up to the chest, okay? Make sure you're squeezing your tummy, head up, let's go. Now if you need a recovery, you can slow it down, right? You can lose those arms. I just need you to keep moving here. Your personal best. Put it in now. Hard work now. Rewards that last a lifetime. Stay with me. This is the part of the workout I need you to push. Okay, push past any fatigue you're feeling, and then drive that knee a little higher. Five seconds. Next move, squat side, right knee pump. So it's only your right leg. Make sure when you step wide, it's nice and wide, so it moves right over ankle. Ooh, let's go. Out, knee. Make sure you push your hips back. Down. Get that knee drive right up to the chest. Your goal is to get a left thigh burn here. You feel the intensity. All low impact, high intensity. Max calorie burn. Come on, lower the hips. Seconds. Walk it out. How are you guys doing? You with me? Same thing, other side. Keep the intensity. Big smile on your face. Strong, positive thoughts. Left side. Let's go. Wide knee. On that step wide, step soft. No banging, right? Land softly. Down, knee pop. Are you pushing your hips back? Make sure the hips go down and back, chest is up. All right, 18 seconds, how can you make it bigger? How can you make it better? Let's go, good form. All right, how's those legs? Next one is bob and weave for four, and then four cross punches. Those cross punches are quick. Bob and weave to begin, let's go. Four, get low. Three, two, four crosses, quick. Drop low, use your legs, chest up. Quick crosses, go. Four, three, two, one. Good, come on. Max calorie burn, go. Bob and weave, low. Cross it quick. Four. Drop low. Four. Three. Two. Quick cross. Let's go. Ten seconds. Come on. Push. Push. Now, cross. Go. Four. Three. Two. One. Drop. Whew, nice job. All right, you have single stars. Only the right leg is going to step out to the side. Low impact stars. Whew, you're going to hurry down. Can you move quick? Let's go. Single stars, just the right. Now, your goal here is to come low on your left leg. Keep the chest up. Now, can you pick up the pace? That's it. Cardio, 
Feels so good. Gives you a high. You're feeling those endorphins pumping through you. Quicker you go, more endorphins you get, the better you feel. Come on, stick with me. 20 seconds quicker. Left thigh is burning, yes, stay with me. Stay with me. Eight seconds. A little scream in that bottom thigh. All right, single stars. Keep moving. Remember, don't just stop. Left leg only, single stars. Begin. It's all about pace here, right? Low impact, so we've got to keep up the intensity. Stay well in your right leg. Can you push your hips back? Drop your hips down just a little more. That's it. Quicken the pace. Quicken. Come on. Keep up that calorie burn. Pace up. Job, guys you have a four count pulse squat four count pulse squat and then four knee drives so you're gonna drop those hips down legs wide go four three two knee drive drop low four three two knee drive drop use your hips low three two knee drive four three two one drop four three two, one, and four, three, 20 seconds. Come on, push lower and knee drive. Four, three, two, go. Four, three, knee drive, four. Drop low, four, three, two, five seconds. Good, awesome job guys, walk it out. We have double crab walk, so come to the left side of your mat, come nice and low. It's just a double crab walk, nice and low. So the ceiling strength, begin. Ceiling strength, you're low. Make sure you push your hips back. Important to push the hips back and keep the chest up. One, two, one, two, one, two, good. A little bit lower, ceiling strength a little more. Gotta push your hips back. Almost there. 20 seconds, a little bit lower. Bring it back so we're even. All right. One move, we repeat, granny jog, because I love this one. Doesn't hurt, right? Doesn't hurt, but you can get that heart rate up. Let's go, 95% of your max right now. 95, so you're holding back 5%, that's not much. So it's almost flat up. Feels good to burn some calories, to work in high intensity, to challenge our body. You know you can go a little faster than that, come on. Just a little quicker, 20 seconds. <clears throat> All right, flat out, last 10 seconds, go. Come to the left side of your mat, so it's shuffle, knee, shuffle, knee. Making sure you step wide. Nothing to trip on. Let's go. Shuffle. Knee. Shuffle. Elbows up. Shuffle. Knee. A little rotation. Elbow to knee. Whew. 
walk it out. Next one is close squat, wide squat. So feet together and then wide, together and wide. Almost time for your break. You have a 30 second break coming, but you gotta work for your break. Push your hips down, wide arms. And making sure the hips go down and back. Reach, step out. Reach, step out. Lower those hips, guys, weight in the heels. You have a thigh burn. Yes, me too. Come a little bit lower in the burn zone. Next one is drop and reach squat four times and then eight count fast feet. Walk it out. Doing great. Stay with me. Drop and reach. Go. Four. Lift the heels. Three. Two, one, fast feet, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, drop, go. Four, lift the heels. Three, two, fast feet, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, drop, go. Lift up. Fast feet, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, drop, and lift. Awesome job. All right, rope climbers is next. So you're just gonna drop low as you can on those legs, climb a rope right up to the sky. It's a heavy rope. Use your muscles, let's go jump in. Heavy rope. Now, you can drop hips lower, Get those arms moving quick because it's a race to the top. The rope is heavy. Use your muscles to grab it quick. A little quicker if you can. Eighteen seconds, come on. Lower those legs. Inline skater, so right leg up, left leg back. Just gonna tap and reach. So both arms are working here, keeping those arms somewhat softly bent. So it's back, tap. Steady your eyes, helps with your balance. Now try to get super light in your left leg and just pump those arms all the way into the right leg. Push your hips back. In lion skater, you're trying to get a good burn in your right thigh. Almost there, keep the pace. How's that right thigh? I know me too, stay with it. Awesome job guys. Other side, your break is coming, one more move. And then we have our 30 second break. So left leg up, right leg back, go. So opposite arm to leg, if that helps you. And then we come a little bit lower in the left leg. A little lower. Get low in that left leg, dip your chest down. All low impact, you can all do this. Stay with me, pop in those arms. One move, and then you have a 30 second break. It's granny jog, but you're going flat out, okay? 100% of your max, you go into the red zone. Come with me, let's go. So it should feel like, hard to breathe, can't talk, let's go. Come on, faster than that, you can do it. 
Run to your break, go. Seconds, keep moving, get some water. Awesome. Here we go. You got your water, you're ready to roll. 30 seconds on. Second half, guys. 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off. It's max out because it's only 30 seconds. Fast feet, go. Okay, fast feet. Only 30 seconds so you can push your body a little bit faster. Go with the endorphins. Those feel goods. Gonna help you to push. Come on, grab some more. A little quicker. Eight seconds. All right, star jumps. We have option one is here. So this is a little easier. You can stick with this option or you're gonna add just a little jump. You don't have to do the jump. So low impact, stay low. Good job. Just 15 seconds, you can do it. Low on those hips. Keep that intensity. Awesome. Next one is hook with knee. So right knee, left arm hook. Great for those abs. Walk it out. Come on, sweat it out. Get a little rotation. Pick up the pace, you got 15 seconds. Squeeze your tummy. You feel that in those abs. Feel that in the heart. Hook and knee. So it's your left knee now. All the weight goes onto that right leg. Whew, let's go. Feels good to work hard. Stay in the zone. All right, a little quicker than that. You can do it. Almost there. Next one is four, lunges back at 50% capacity, then eight at your max out, okay? Whew, let's go, four, three, two, max out. Don't straighten your arms all the way. Four, three, two, slow it down for four, three, two, keep the bend in the elbow, go quick. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, slow it down, four, three, pick it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Slow it down. Go, just to the end. Good job, walk it out. Whew. We're going high knee crunches, but this time we're getting a crossover high knee crunch, okay? Abs on, arms up, go. How are you feeling? Feeling good, right? Give me your best right here. Come on, workout's almost done. This is where we push. This is where results happen. Good, feel that. Makes you happy, right? Come on, a little quicker than that. Eight seconds, time to push. Whew. Next one is a squat. So you're gonna come low into a squat and then just punch with rotation. Great for those abs, shake it, shake it. All right, let's get low. Go, one, two. Get a rotation. Low in those legs. Good, 
So we're trimming up the abs, we're strengthening the muscles, we're strengthening the heart. And it's like three workouts in one. 15 seconds, go. Awesome job. Mountain climbers is next, so you're down. If your heart rate's too high, stay up and march. Mountain climbers, it's only 30 seconds. So you can walk, you can jog, you can run. Keep your head up. You know you wanna run, come on. Workout is almost done. Squeeze your abs, hug knee to chest. Come on, go flat out right now. Awesome job, guys. Walk it out. Next one, back to granny jog. Two minutes, two minutes. Whew. Let's go. Come on, let's go. 95%. Feels good to be fit. Feels good to be fast. You can go faster than that, come on. Hard work's almost done. Six seconds, almost there. All right, chair pose with the arm circle, guys. So, feet together or hip distance, backwards arm circle. So those arms, they keep that heart rate up. Woo, let's go back. Now, you know you can go lower than that. Oh yes, there we are. Get into the zone and enjoy it. That's why you're here. That's why you arrived, because you love hard workouts. Come on, drop hips lower. Yes, we love hard. Come on, 10 seconds. Back to those toe taps, these ones. You can walk it or you can pick up that pace. All right, let's go. One, two, one, two. Just add a little spring in your step. Come on, get moving. Like it's almost done. Fifteen seconds. Awesome. All right, it's a pulse squat, just two, and then the right knee drive. Then we're gonna go to the left. Pull squat two, right knee drive. Let's go. One, two, right. One, two, left. Drop low. Right. One, two. One, two. One, two. Drop low in hips. Reach low. And reach. Strong reach. 10 seconds. One, two. One, two. One, two, Whew. awesome job guys. Fast feet is next. One move, one move, this is it. Fast feet, 30 seconds, and standing cardio is done. Let's go, last move. Your fastest feet. Come on, shake it out, have some fun, feel good. All right, every one of you, faster than that. Right now, 15 seconds, go. Faster than that, you can do it. Five seconds, flat out. Walk it out. I need you to recover. Now recover, we're still in cardio zone. We're gonna do cardio down on the mat, but we need to get that heart rate down just to maybe about 60%, 50% max, right? So let's take a deep breath in here. Deep breath out, so that just means on a scale of one to 10, you're like a five or a six, but we're gonna keep that heart rate up for floor cardio abs. Exhale, inhale up, exhale, last go. Last one, inhale, 
exhale all right march it out let's come on down you can use your wrist supports if you like or a set of dumbbells we're back into 30 second intervals high plank position extend your legs you're just going to go mountain climber slow slow and then step out out so bring it in for two step out for two so in in and out out keep your head up because that heart rate is still going in, in, and, and out. Good job, eight seconds. Drive me in and step wide. Awesome, on your knees. You're gonna come back into a half camel. So halfway back and the arms are gonna punch down, forward and down, okay? You're gonna keep that heart rate up. Here we go, half camel, punch, forward, down forward, down, squeeze your bum, all about keeping that heart rate up, bracing your abs. This is front and back core, thighs, cardio. Your thighs burning, right? Stay with me, come on. Eight seconds. Back to high plate, guys. All right. You're just gonna go for a walk. You're gonna walk the knees in and out and then switch lead legs, okay? Let's go, in and out, switch legs. And out, keep your head up, heart rate's kicking. And in, out. Couple more moves and the workout is done. Stay strong. Eight seconds. Awesome. Onto your bum. Whew. Look at that. Heart rate's been up for 44 minutes. Extend your legs out in front of you. We have Russian twists. Knuckles together. Let's go. Two moves and you're done. Come on. Hollow out that tummy. Keep the pace. Squeeze in your abdominals. You're almost there. Last 10. Keep hollowing your tummy, feeling that big abdominal scoop. All right, guys, last move. You're on your forearms. Come back. Um, fingertips towards your bum. Hollow out that tummy. Lift those legs. You can lie on your back for an easier option. Bicycle. One, two, one, two. You're feeling supercharged and ready to continue your day with strong energy. Come on, guys. Push through the pain. <sighs> Stick with me. We get stronger together. We get better together. Better version of ourselves. Last 10 seconds, come on. <sighs> Push now. <sighs> you did it. All right, let's stretch. Right leg up, left leg back. Oh, forearm to thigh. Slide your back knee right back. Get off that kneecap. Backhand slides to lower back, hip area. All right, catch your breath for the first time in 45 minutes. Inhale and exhale. Feel the feel goods flowing through you. That's why you're here. That's why you work so hard to get those endorphins. So just feel them. Inhale. Exhale, drop down. Inhale. Exhale. Once more, inhale, exhale. Let's come into a half split posture. Go ahead and straighten that front leg. Flex the foot, push your knee down, lengthen the spine. How good do you feel now? Feel proud, feel strong, feel re-energized. Deep breaths, push the knee down, inhale, and exhale. Good, inhale. Exhale, once more, long, slow breath, square your chest, right down to your thigh. Great, switch sides. Make sure the bottom knee, you're gonna push it right back, getting off that kneecap, forearm to thigh, slide hand to lower back and hip area, and then roll the shoulders back, inhale. Exhale, drop the hip down, inhale. 
exhale. How good does that feel? Nice deep stretch for that hip flexor. Dropping hip down towards the earth. Take one more inhale and exhale. Coming back, half split posture. So straightening that front leg, flexing the foot. Push the knee down, push the lower back forward. Nice, long spine. So rather than rounding, try to push your lower back forward. Slow, deep breaths. Feeling good. Slow inhale. Slow exhale. Once more, inhale. And exhale. All right. Facing me, just bring those legs nice and wide. Make sure your heels line up. Just go for a little side lunge, one side. Drop your hips down. Keep your chest up. Nice little stretch for groin, inner thigh. And other side. Good. Drop your hips down, you guys. Don't forget, you want to try to get minimum 75 minutes a week of cardiovascular training of intense um, cardio. If you're doing a moderate to low intensity, you need 150 minutes a week. So like a light walk, you'll need 150 minutes. If you're doing exercise like this or more intense, you'll need 75 minutes a week. That's a minimum from the American Heart Association. Workout done. Great job, you guys. Make sure you hydrate. Take a little more time for stretching if you like. And if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know how you did. And if you want to get notifications weekly when I upload new videos, which is every Wednesday and Friday, please click subscribe, the little bubble up here, and click the bell, and you'll get notifications when a new video is uploaded. Lots of variety. Have a beautiful day. Enjoy.